Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Ashley and if you are new here, I would love it if you consider subscribing and if you already have, welcome back. And today is my 33 week update, so let's just get right to it. So I am 33 weeks and I think um, three days today. Um, when you see this, I'll be a couple of days, more like almost 34 weeks. Um, but I'm gonna try to keep this super short and sweet because my camera is running out of battery and all of the extra batteries are out. So, <laughs> um, uh, checking on the Ovia app. I'm so out of breath. Um, it says that baby is about the size of a cauliflower blossom, but way cuter. <laughs> um, my baby actually measured 34 weeks instead of 33 <laughs> so she's a little bit bigger um, than what she's supposed to be or what's expected for her to be and this does not come as a surprise to me because she is really tight in there or at least I feel like she's tight she is in position my <laughs> provider actually has really big eyes um, and when she went to feel where the baby's head was at her eyes like were about to pop out of her face because <laughs> she's kind of low um, but she's in position, which is great because it means that I'm, she's getting ready to be born. But um, she's kind of getting low, so um, the pressure's on to get everything ready before she's here. Um, baby's heart rate is great. It was in the 140s. Um, my blood pressure was really great. I, as far as symptoms, I have been super, super dizzy a lot, like almost every single day. And I know it doesn't have anything to do with my blood sugar because it happens even after I eat. Um, it doesn't have to do with my blood pressure because it's actually really great. So my doctor just recommended checking my blood again to make sure that I am not anemic because last time I was like borderline anemic, but um, she didn't think I needed medication, but maybe now I, I might need to have to take medication because we don't know wh why I'm so dizzy. Um, other than that, a lot of Braxton Hicks, horrible, horrible heartburn, especially at night. If I don't have my medication, I am up all night. She moves all the time, like constantly, constantly moving. I do the kicking count and it doesn't take too long before I already have to count to 10 and I'm done with it. Um, I feel like she's a nocturnal baby because she likes to move at night so much so that she actually wakes me up. And already it's so hard for me to sleep because I can't get in the right position. Everything is uncomfortable, but everything overall has been so, so great. And I am super grateful for everything. And yeah, they had me register at the hospital. So things are getting real. Um, I have a sonogram for scheduled for two weeks ahead of today. And my next appointment is in two weeks too on the same day. So that should be exciting. Um, they had me get some baby aspirin just in case, so it's just preventative. So I, I don't know, to just lower the chance of preeclampsia because I did get that last time. Um, but overall, the appointment was super smooth. Everything looked great. Baby girl looks big <laughs> and healthy. And um, I'm just trying to um, not get too stressed out because I have been super stressed these past couple of days because of um, other things that have nothing to do with pregnancy, just family issues, um, um, my husband's job uh, related issues. So I'm trying to keep it cool and not get too stressed out and not worry too much until after the baby's born because I don't want anything to, um, you know, upset the baby or go, make me go into labor earlier. But I will definitely be updating you um, during my next weeks appointment or the next two week appointment like at 35 weeks um and i am super close to a thousand subscribers so once i hit that i will be doing a giveaway so if you haven't subscribed don't forget to click that subscribe button before you go and if you are interested at all in that giveaway i definitely recommend that you click that subscribe button thank you so much for watching i will definitely be showing you a belly shot i have not forgotten <laughs> so thank you so much for watching